This is the dropship has crashed with another one of my mocks. Wait a second. Villain? No. Doesn't have a hero core on it. Can't be a hero. It must be a Bionicle! I'm starting doing Bionicle mocks. Yes. Now this is Neo. The Toa of neon colors. Yes. You know what? Someone has to start somewhere. And it was just an easy name for me. And just, there's a lot of neon colors with this awesome garden that I made. So, you know what? Deal with the, the real name. I mean, it's very bad, I know, but it will have to do for now. In the future, I'll try to come out with other names that are actually way better than this. And actually might be actually a Toa in the real world. Now, the whole color scheme for this guy is green and white. A little bit of orange and red in there. Now, here's a big energy tank that powers up the gun. And here's a smaller energy tank and this runs out. It shoots it the single... He can make it. He can form this giant missile out of the energy stored in here and here to make this giant missile and shoot it. Very neon. I used a lot of neon colors in this. A lot of them. You see, I used the lots of regular Lego pieces. That's neon colored. Sorry about that. Um. Then on the end, you have the Baraki eyepiece. That's from Nitro Blast. Um, now, I got this idea from Search Tube now. And I really hold it in both hands because it just added to the whole character. And added it and made it so much better. And also, I used the regular Hero Factory torso for 2010, but with this scale back beetle kind of thing from Takanuba. And I used the right shoulder armor on the ends of these Matoran limbs. So I wanted to use those for new, something new. So that's basically why I did that. And this is Neo, the Toa of Neon Colors, and I'll be seeing you guys some other time with other Bionicle Marks. Yay!